Hello YouTube and welcome to Bunting Guitars. Thanks guys for the playing. Thank you. It was amazing. Yeah. I'm Yaniv. Uh, and today we're going to introduce to you a new model, the Willow. The Willow. The Willow is a semi-hollow guitar. Yes. Our first semi-hollow guitar. And in this video we're going to go through the specs, uh, the acoustic specs, the electric specs, and and later on, Guy will demo them for you so you can hear the different sounds. So, uh, let's start with the woods. Basically, the, the concept of the tone woods is uh, very influenced by flat top acoustic guitars. Uh, much smaller body, but you got a solid spruce top that uh, will thickness it to 3 mil. And the back of the guitar, it's one piece genuine mahogany. Also, we get it as thin as we can, 3 mil to keep it uh, really resonance with the top yes. and make the, bo the box really <coughs> come, to, come to life and vibrate, vibrate together. Yes. Uh, we leave a block in the middle just half the way of, half away of the body to keep uh, all the vibrations and sustain from the bridge to the body mm -hmm. and reduce uh, all the feedback that we can under the pickups. The same as you can see, there's no effort in the body. Uh, we like the style and the look, but it also helps to reduce the feedback. Yes. Um, for the fretboard, we went for ebony. It's uh, also a hint for the uh, 60s acoustic style guitars. And it works really good with a hollow body construction. Uh, keeps the note very separate and uh, and clear and takes mo most of the energy and the sustain to the box um, and we did kind of the inlay style of uh, flat top yes and <coughs> to, to keep it kind of y unique to this model mm -hmm. yes yeah, so as we mentioned it's very acoustic uh, flavor the instrument and it sounds a very nice uh, unplugged sound you can sit with it in the end of the day on your couch and not bother anyone and still have a good time um, not as loud as an acoustic of course but so in terms of uh, hardware which uh, which we uh, had uh, specially made for this uh, model uh, so we designed this tailpiece um, come it comes from arch top designs basically uh, we were going for that look and style of an arch top. Um, so we designed the tailpiece and the base plate. Um, and we have uh, a solid brass uh, compensated saddle for the bridge, uh, which gives us a nice, uh, nice twangy kind of sound. Uh, it also goes well with the fact that it's a bolt-on guitar and not a set neck guitar. Uh, which I think together is a, these are two features that make this guitar a bit spankier, twangier than what you're used to in semi-hollows. Um, so yeah, this guitar kind of bridges between two worlds of the sound. Yeah, I think it's one of the reasons that this guitar became so unique and interesting. Mm. Like basically, the the woods and the pickups are. Can be pretty classic for 50s, 60s hollow body guitars, but uh, the mix with the uh, with the unique uh, hardware and the sound of the brass and the bolt on, and the short scale that's a 24 and a half inch scale, uh, give it a really unique response and sustain and kind of twang. Yeah. Um, that that you feel immediately. So yeah, about pickups which you mentioned, it's pickup time. So we have. Uh two basic sets on, on the Willow. One is the TV Jones T. Armand pickup. Um, basically the old uh, 50s Gretsch style pickup, single coil, very articulate, very clear. They never get muddy, no matter what you do to them. You can play on the, on the neck pickup. It's very sweet and you will hear it next in the, in the videos. Um, these are my favorite. <laughs> and uh, on the other side is um, is a PAF style uh, humbuckers. Yeah, we, we use Dr. Vintage 
a set of PAF made by Wolfton. Um, and we love them. That's exactly how PAF style pickups so or mm-hmm. any humbuckers should sound and react. Uh, that will be my favorite. Yes. Uh, I think it's uh, really versatile on a hollow body guitar. In, uh, in clean, you can use uh, the neck and it will still sound very clear and separate and never get muddy. Yes. And you can go to rock and press on your drive pedals and that really react how you expect a good humbuckers to react. Uh, yes, yeah, so we went over most of the specs. So you can find out everything you want to find out if you want to go to our website and there's a link in the description. Um, Please subscribe to our channel for more updates and videos uh, to come. Those two uh, will be available on our website for available. a short time. Yes. But you can custom order and uh, feel free to contact us with any question or, or ideas yes. or dreams you got. Uh, so I will go out of the frame and let Guy play and demo them for you. Thank you. Thank you. Peace.